Surprise! I don't like school. So you know what I did? I peed on it. All right, so yes, I did pee on my school. To understand why I did it and how I got in trouble for it, we need to go back, like way back. Why is there a car in the classroom? It all started in sixth grade, final period before lunch. We were just learning about like, I don't know, factors in math. I did not sign up for this. So during lunch at my school, once you're done eating, you have to go outside and play in the big yard. But there's another yard that you're not allowed to go to because it's not supervised during lunch. So before my class ended, I asked my friend at the time, Matt, if him and two of our other friends wanted to hang out in the unsupervised yard. Matt said yes. Now, as soon as the lunch bell rang, me and the boys ran to the cafeteria so we could eat our lunches as soon as possible. As soon as we finished eating, we booked it out to the other yard. And when we got there, we did what normal kids do. We filmed YouTube videos. We repeated this for days, weeks, maybe even months. Eventually, the teachers started catching on. But there was this one teacher, same as Mr. Carl. He was one of our gym teachers. And the problem is that his office was literally right inside the wall of the school that we were playing at. So he was the one who caught us the most and eventually busted us. Now, me and the boys did this for a couple of months, but the whole peeing on the school thing happened before any of this actually happened. So let me tell you how and why I peed on my school. So I was in the other yard by myself one lunch I was just standing around, then it hit me. You know that feeling when you gotta go? Like, really bad? Okay, I'm sorry, I had to go, okay? I couldn't just hold it in. At least, it couldn't get any worse than that, right? Oh, crap. That right there is true fear. Because once you start, you can't stop. Come on. What are you doing here, Josh? I, uh, I, I, I'm really, uh, I needed to go to the, uh, washroom. Why would you go on the school wall? I, uh, I, I really need to go in. That is no excuse! How dare you pee on the school and on the school walls! You should be extremely ashamed of yourself. I know, but I, I, the door was locked and- Okay, you know what? Just go. I, I know, but- Just go! I'm going to- GO! It was at that moment I realized that Mr. Carl meant trouble. He was on to us. I really hoped that we would be able to avoid him, but- I wouldn't be making this video if everything was fine and Mr. Carl didn't bust us again. Hey, that was a pretty sweet shot. What did I tell you kids about playing in this yard? No, 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 it's, it's not what you think. Uh, we, we were just leaving. Yeah, dude, we were just leaving. Take a chill pill. <laughs> I have had ENOUGH of your not listening! You're coming with me! PRINCIPAL TIME! Can I, uh, can I help you? Is the principal busy? Yes, actually. She and the vice principal are very busy. You're right, Mr. Vice Principal. We need to beat the children when they misbehave and should cut all teacher salaries by 80%. You're the turtles! E excuse me, sir. What is the meaning of this nonsense? These kids have been playing in the South Yard unsupervised for a couple of months now. I've been letting them off the hook and giving them chances. They've had their chance and they keep abusing it. Punish them! Well... We will have to do something about them growing in that yard, but I think I- Also, Josh peed on the school bricks. What? You did what? I, uh... Oh. 
To be honest, the principal didn't really care that I peed on the school. She kind of just said whatever and told Mr. Carl to leave the office. She then told us not to go in the yard or else we will actually start getting into trouble. She was pretty chill about it. And guess what? We never went back to that other yard again. And that's how I got away with peeing on my school, kids. Eventually, me and the boys started leaving the school campus and walking down a street where there's a bunch of stores to eat lunch. The moral of the story? Things could always get worse. Wow, that was a really good big night. <laughs>Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave it a like and subscribe to the channel if you aren't already. It really helps out a ton and you could always change your mind if you want to later. Uh, one announcement that next month I have a very special project in the works. It's not going to be a normal animation, it's going to be some special thing I've been working on for a while and it's going to come out next month. So. Stay tuned for that, and without further ado, I'll see you guys next month. Goodbye.